Okay. So we're going to be guiding you through the sacred Odin journey. You're going to be going into a, a deep, relaxed, meditative state. And I'm going to be giving you some, some guidance on things that you're going to be doing. And then I'm also going to be uh, calling in or invoking um, things both in English language and what would be called star language, soul language, light language, um, language of magic. Uh, it goes beyond the conscious mind, deeper into the soul. And so you may not consciously understand, you probably won't, uh, which is perfect. We're going deeper than the conscious logical mind, down to your heart, down to your soul, to, uh, we'll say, clean things up, to restore you. Um, one of the myths of Odin is how he recovers or how he brings forth these nine spell songs, nine magic songs. And so it's potential one of those, one or multiple of those may start coming through as well. And these are healing songs to release you, release uh, enslavement, release restriction, release fear and trauma in your body and start opening things up. Uh, you may feel some release. You may feel like you need to shake or stretch or cry or yell. Any of that is totally welcome, um, totally important to do if you feel so inspired as we clear things out of your system. We've all got things. I've had things I've had to clear out, and that's that's even why I can be here today because of what I've cleared out so I can bring you this gift. So as you clear it out for yourself, you assist others, and uh, we're all in this together, all of you wonderful people here with me tonight. So with that, let's begin. Let's close our eyes. Let's begin opening our breath. Begin allowing our breath to soften and to deepen and to open. And just hold yourself in gratitude and love and appreciation that you are here, that you're taking this time for yourself to tune into this. I'm so grateful you're here with me. This is a true blessing that we're here, that we're alive, that we're breathing, that we're breathing deeply together. You feel your body relaxing. As you breathe, feel your breath opening the body. Feel your breath deepening. And as you breathe, feel your body, allow your body to begin to relax. Each muscle begins to gently let go. Your feet, your legs, melting like honey, like wax, into your chair, into your cushions. Breathing into your stomach and your back, opening your back, opening your stomach. Feeling your neck and your shoulders and your arms opening with the breath so that you're breathing life force, breathing oxygen into those areas of your body.
and feeling your entire body begin to open and settle in. And continue breathing as I begin to call in Odin, as I begin to call in his great hall around us. And just continue breathing, feeling your body opening in a receptive state as if your cells as if your cells are opening to receive this. Your cells are breathing this in, just holding that intention and that focus. We open the eternal tree of life codex within the bodies of all those that are on this call and watching this and I call forth and invoke Odin, the Divine One, the All-Father We open the channels of Asgard and Valhalla within your body We call forth the temple of Valhalla to surround us within us and around us to sanctify this entire space even though we're far apart in the physical, I draw us together in this unified space of the hala of Odin's hall. And breathe into this, feeling your heart opening. If you need to put your heart on your your hand on your heart, we call forth the rivers of me, the rivers of life, the rivers of joy and prosperity, the rivers of freedom and love. Into your bodies to flow through you. And as you continue to breathe, feel imagining rivers of gold and liquid flowing through your body, drawing that into anywhere in your body that you know needs some support, digestive system, cardiovascular system, muscles, lymphatic system, to the mind. We call forth Odin, the All-Father, to be there with you, and we welcome his presence to support you and hold you. And imagine this figure before you, this powerful, strong, masculine presence. He might look like a strong warrior or perhaps an old man with a staff or spear, perhaps a mystic, a wizard, perhaps with both eyes or just one eye. You may feel him, you may visualize him. We call forth and invoke Odin, Anatukum, Dalakis, Is, Is, And Odin comes before you, Anarasun, Dalakirakum, as the true divine masculine, as the true divine archetype of the masculine force of creation that penetrates through the world, penetrates through illusion, penetrates through fear, penetrates through doubt and scarcity and pain and Odin is there with you and he sees through he sees your pains he sees your trials he sees the challenges you've gone through and you can share those with an, with an open heart pains, the struggles maybe the pains and challenges with your father pains and challenges of being a female and dealing with men, <laughs> the challenges of being a man and understanding what that means. Uh, the struggles we've all faced as women and men 
with our masculine principle, how to be strong and honorable, noble and apart. We've all had our trials and our tribulations, our struggles. And here you can offer these to Odin. You can share them with Odin. He sees them for what they are. And you continue to breathe. Imagine all this stuff coming out of your system. Pain, the fear. Mm. And Odin calls forth his magic to surround you and hold you. Odin's magic releases these bonds and these chains. This pain within your body. He comes to hold you. He bows before you in appreciation for your strength and your power and your wisdom and your desire to go through these challenges and come out of them. He recognizes you have gone through your version of the underworld La liene la ku, la ku, la linda la ku. And he welcomes you back unto your own Valhalla. And he runs this magic, this golden light through your body with you. He's supporting you and drawing it into your body. And join it into your life. What areas of your life are you struggling with or feel as though you're struggling with? To your bank accounts and to your partnerships and your relations, to your home, to your health, to your heart. Odin's love, Odin's magic is limitless. Dalakum dalako, limitless like yours. Ashkan yalakum balalalanda. Siakana. Continue breathing. Deep breaths. Imagining your body opening and releasing, receiving what it needs from Odin to pour this precious mead of light, this precious mead of honey, of life, of sweetness, the nectar of life into your body. You've gone through life this life and many others. You've been beaten down. You've struggled. You faced <laughs> horrific things and sadness, pain and anger, doubt and confusion, uncertainty. Perhaps you felt lost. And it's all part of the journey through the underworld, my friend. And now drink this meat into your body, into your life. Imagine it restoring your system, pouring through you. And these sound frequencies, these sound, song, spells penetrating into your cells. I am drawing forth the realms of the hala, the song, the tone into your body, resonating like like strings of musical instruments, resonating the strings, the energy channels within your system back to the original 
Vahalik or heavenly state Arakum Baliandai Anarayu Anasi Unarakupuana. Re resonating, retuning the divine instrument of your body back to its true frequency, its true tone, its true song. The song of your heart, the spell songs within your heart. Feel your heart, imagining your heart resonating like a beautiful instrument. Your heart generates blood flow, it generates electricity, it elect generates power through your body. And Odin and you go through your entire system, we're scanning your entire system, and clearing out. Anything and everything that is ready to be released and cleared from your system. His magic is going in like surgery into your system to cleanse the fears and the doubts, conscious or unconscious. Within you and around you. Restore the glory of your heart to restore the glory of your soul and its infinite power. Breathe this all the way down to your stomach as best you can. And breathe out the tension, the stress. Take a deep breath. You might make some sound with that breath. Feel your body opening. Feel your body connecting with its power again. As we draw forth the ancient magic that you are, and synchronize it in perfect connection, and perfect alignment within your body, within your consciousness, within your heart. And imagine Odin walking around you, circling around you, camping and holding space for you, seeing you in your divinity as you allow yourself to release anything that is not your truth. These are the songs of Odin to set you free and restore you to your truth. And we call forth the sacred ancient ruins of magic and the original codex of light around you. To sanctify the universe that is you. To sanctify the god goddess that is you. We break these chains and these false archetypes that are no longer who you are. Within you and around you, and as you release this from yourself, you're reprogramming humanity itself, and the earth itself. For this is what you came here for, my friend. Odin and Aaron are here to remind you. And within the circle around you, within this universe of your consciousness, they call forth the love that you are, the wholeness that you are, the heaven that you are. They call forth Valhalla. We call forth Asgard. We call forth all pieces of your soul across time and space, across all the nine realms. Restoring your power back to restoring the energetic quantum infinite power that you are. Throughout the entire tree of life, the ancestral lines, to the rivers of consciousness that you flow through. Restore the potentiality, the possibility, the truth 
of Asgard, of Valhalla, of heaven within your human framework. We draw forth the realms above and the realms below to unify within your heart, within your life. You allow yourself to breathe this in. Begin envisioning, envisioning and feeling your highest desires, your highest truth. What does your highest life potential look like? Who are you with? What are you doing? Who did you come here for? What is your purpose? The purpose is not something to seek. The purpose is the truth of who you are, my friend. Allow your imagination to begin to unveil that, to create that, to display that. Allow the heaven that you are to percolate through you, to allow the fountain of heavens to open up within your body, rising up to your spine, rising to your heart and your breath. What did you come here to do in this life? What is the unification of everything you are? Begin to feel that, envision that. Where are you living? What are you creating? Allowing the freedom channels of money, the freedom channels of resources, the freedom channels of connection, to flow through you. As Odin, we call forth Freya, the divine goddess, to bring her prosperity channels within you as well. Allowing her goddess channels to flow through you to help you unify the entire vision of your soul's purpose back into your body, back into your heart again. And as you envision this and feel this as best you can, you're activating the heart to begin generating. The heart is your power chamber. The heart is your engine of creation in this life. As we balance all these energies, your heart can begin to activate its full power to start actually shifting your reality. And so we're drawing in the vision, the feeling, and unifying that through the heart into your world. What does your life look like? What does your life feel like? What do you feel like? Who are you in this new life, in this true life? And as Odin sacrificed his eye, what are you willing to let go of? What needs to be cleared from your life to make way for your truth? What habits are based off old fear and anxiety? Is it food? Is it toxicants? Is it toxic relations? Is it living in a toxic place? Is it working a toxic job? What in your life is based around old fears and restrictions and is not in alignment with the truth of your heart and your soul? Then we ask the All Father and the All Mother, Odin and Freya of Frigg, to support you and surround you and hold you to your highest vision and break the chains of that which needs to be released from your system, released from your life. Placing those toxicities in your life with your divine vision, divine truth of who you are. And 
if you were Odin, if you were Freya, what would you be doing with your life? Breathing deeply, receiving this as your being. Receiving the truth, your being with Odin and Freya there supporting you, and begin to envision that around you are overlaying this purpose is a golden temple as the most beautiful temple, beautiful space you've ever seen glorious and uplifting and here in the sanctuary in this temple you feel the truth of who you are you're radiating a luminous being And around you is your true soul family, stellar, magical beings just like you. All holding you, all seeing you, and all beaming you so much love and appreciation and gratitude for all you are, all you've ever been, all you've ever gone through. And they welcome you home. They welcome you to the celebration. And here you can be at peace. You can feel yourself opening, unraveling. And from this space, you see Odin and Freya again before you, and they bow to you, and they sing one more song of magic to open what's known as the Bifrost, it is the rainbow bridge that connects the worlds. And so we open this rainbow bridge, this bridge of light, of awareness from the celestial space, from this heavenly space from this true space to your human heart, to your human experience. We are literally bridging, unifying the dimensions within you so that your life begins to resonate or correlate or synchronize with the truth of the heaven that you are. And so together we open these bridges Imagine a beautiful rainbow light blue 
coming down through you. So it's the sparkling energy of consciousness of heaven, of Asgard, flowing into your body, penetrating into your cells, synchronizing, as I said, in this truth vision of who you are into your body to embody it, to draw it forth, to penetrate into the physical world, the spiritual truth of who you are. Penetrating into your cells, into the particles of your body, penetrating into any areas in your body you know need some support. And those are areas reminding you to draw this energy into them. So let's take another three deep breaths together. And as you're ready, Odin and Freya bless you, hold you, hug you. And are grateful for you for being here tonight. And know that they are with you always. The All Father and the All Mother, the Father of us all, the Mother of us all, the creative forces of nature of the universe. For this is the ancient truth. And as you're ready, you can begin to slowly move your body, slowly move your fingers and toes, slowly come back into this reality, trusting and knowing the true reality that you are actually existing in, and thus now bringing in to your 3D world. You are synchronizing, you are downloading that into this world. We are downloading that truth into this world. Together, we have a greater bandwidth <laughs> and higher speed. And as you begin to take in the world, around you, continue to hold this truth within you, and thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me tonight on this journey, and as this is a, a new format, a new offering, I would love, 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 and appreciate any feedback sharing of your experience. You can send me something in the chat here. You can send me an email. You can send me a Facebook message posted in the group. And I wanted to offer to all of you, if you don't already know, I'm going to be on April 24th beginning a nine-week journey called Ancient Myth and Magic. It'll be going more in-depth in this. It's nine courses two hours each, going through the entire tree of life, going through all the realms on the tree of life. So we're going to be doing some intensive power reclamation and restoration in your system using the Norse mythology, using Odin, or not using Odin, with Odin. <laughs> Odin is your guide. Freya is your guide. And many other magical beings that are part of Norse mythology, the elves, the dwarves, the veneer, the seer, the Valkyrie, the giants. We have so much to reclaim and restore, come back into the fullness and bring forth the entire tree of life 
we are, to bring forth all the realms that we are, all the magic we are. And so for those of you on the call tonight, on this webinar, I've got a special coupon here for that class for 15% off. That's uh, about $166 off the class. Coupon is Odin15. I'm putting in the chat here. That will get you 15% off the course. The course we're going to be going more in depth. There's going to be practices. There's going to be a private Facebook group. We're going to be able to dive into all this more deeply, connect. I'm going to be there to support you more intensely. You're going to get one-on-one -on -one sessions with me to help you navigate and clear stuff out of your system, you know, stuff that's probably been bogging you down for hundreds of thousands of years. So um, it's going to be an amazing, amazing class. There's going to be a lot of great content, a lot of magic that can help you whatever area of life, in all areas of life that you need. Um, we're going to be going just like through Od like Odin did through the many different dimensions of the Tree of Life and restoring, reclaiming our power, our gifts, our truths, and opening up, restoring our heavenly abode in this world. This life, this human experience is our potential to access heaven or Asgard in our life. And so please join me on the journey, the deeper journey, uh, starting again April 24th. Use the code ODIN15, and if you need to, I can also do some payment plans, payment options on that. So there's some options on the site, or reach out to me if you need to support to get in there. Uh, it's going to be an amazing class with lots of good stuff, a lot of new stuff, and a lot of ancient stuff that's been lost. I've been uh, doing a lot of research to bring this lost gift to you and uh, restore the need of life within you, the joy of life the love of life, the prosperity of life, the joy and the love and prosperity of the goddess, restoring that back into your cellular structure, back into your energetic structure, so that you can begin to really feel who you are in yourself and in your life, so your life begins to reflect what you truly are. Often we have a disconnect, right? We feel there's something more, there's something greater for us, and many of us struggle with uh, actuating that, and the time is now um, major transformations for me here that is allowing me to pass this on to you. So uh, everything is shifting, up leveling, expanding here very rapidly. So please join me on this amazing journey. Uh, it was a wonderful place to be in opening you. Reach out if you've got any questions. Reach out if I can support you. Um, and thank you, thank you, thank you for being with me tonight. Thank you for your love. Yes, send me some messages. Thank you. Thanks for being up so late in the UK. <laughs> Thank you, Ava. Perfect tuning. Love it. Love it. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, uh, Kieran. I believe that's your name. I love it. And yes, get some sleep. Reach out to me soon. We'd love to know more. And I'll, I'll hang out here. If anybody's got any questions, love and light, Cynthia. Thank you. Thank you. So much love to all of you. Have a beautiful night. Make sure to rest. Be as peaceful as you can. If you can do a salt bath, that is amazing. If you can go out in nature, that is amazing. Uh, try to be as quiet as possible. Try not to engage with others or social media or um, any technology as, as little as you can. Just allow yourself to relax and uh, integrate this and have a peaceful sleep tonight. Thank you, Ray. Mm, thank you, thank you so much for being with me tonight. All right, everybody. Again, enjoy your evening. Rest well. Drink some water. Reach out to me, Facebook. 
Aaron Michael Pine, Instagram, Aaron Michael Pine, website, email. I'll put all of it here in the chat if you need it. Okay, everyone. Have a beautiful, beautiful night. Look forward to connecting with you more another time. And uh, may Odin be with you. Good night, good night.